What the heck is lint, and where does it come from? I've been wondering this question for a really long time. It's always baffled me at how much lint would show up in the dryer. The clothes are supposed to be clean! Where did it come from? It's actually quite simple. Lint is made up mostly of parts of your clothes. Clothes are made up of thousands of little tiny fibers. When washing and drying, many get torn or ripped and can pretty easily fall off. Every time you wear and wash a shirt, about one one thousandth of it comes off as lint. But as the shirt gets older, it's actually less likely to lose those fibers. This is another reason why really old towels tend to get thinner over time. The reason why all the lint ends up getting bundled together in the dryer is mostly from static electricity. When the clothes are getting tumbled around, they rub up against each other and form a charge. The charge helps those little fibers stick together. It also doesn't hurt that all of the extra air is exhausted through the screen trap. I know what you're thinking. Belly button lint. Most adult men get belly button lint. It can seem kind of weird and obviously kind of gross, but let's explain what's going on. First of all, yes, it does happen. If it doesn't happen to you, you'll find out why in just a second. The belly button lint is again tiny fibers from your shirt. You'll notice that the lint will be a similar color to the shirt that you're wearing. The shirt rubs off against all the hairs on your stomach, tearing off tiny little pieces of fibers, and of course creating a static charge. The science on why it all goes to the belly button is not completely sound, but the likely explanation is that it's just the easiest place for it to bundle up. If you want to keep your belly button clean as a whistle, make sure you shave your stomach hair. Or just don't wear a shirt. Now you know where the crazy lint stuff comes from. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you press the like button, and have a super duper delicious day.